women with diabetes, especially have, if they have metabolic syndrome in conjunction with diabetes. Metabolic syndrome is a compilation of different, different small risk factors like increased weight. So if you're obese, if you have a waist that's bigger than 35 inches for women, greater than 40 inches for men, you probably have metabolic syndrome. That means you have a lot of fat in your abdomen that can increase your risk of heart disease. So if you have metabolic syndrome and you have diabetes, that really increases your risk for having a heart attack or stroke. Now, it's especially bad for women, and we don't know why it's such a bad risk factor for women, but a woman with diabetes will have a higher risk of heart disease than a man with diabetes. And more often than not, that woman with diabetes will not be treated for her heart. Now, we're taught as physicians that if you're a diabetic and you're over 40, you should be treated as if you've already had a heart attack. And there are so many people that are not being treated as such. And there was a recent report that in the last few decades, from 1971 to 2000, the decline is significant in mortality from diabetes in men, but there was no decline at all in women. Again, this is discrimination for women with diabetes. We are not aggressively treating women with diabetes. Doctors are not aggressive in protecting women's hearts when they have diabetes. A diabetic over 40 years old should be on the fabulous four drugs, aspirin, beta blockers, ACE inhibitors, and statins. And the women that I see in the hospital who've had a stroke, who've had a devastating stroke so that they'll never walk again or talk again or die from that stroke, or they'll have a heart attack. Those women with diabetes are often not on even an aspirin, let alone the ACE inhibitor, which protects their kidneys, protects their hearts. So I'm seeing so many women who have diabetes who are not even being given one protective drug for their hearts. And this has got to stop. We have really got to empower women with diabetes. And when I give lectures all over the country, there are so many women writing down, oh, I'm supposed to be on that, because they're not. Their doctors are not giving them the right drugs for their hearts to protect their hearts when they're diabetic. So I really want to emphasize that women with diabetes over the age of 40 should be protected should protect their hearts and be given these drugs.